A large crowd of women in Kaduna staged a peaceful protest demanding justice and restoration of the people's mandate after the declaration of Senator Uba Sani of APC as the winner of the governorship poll. Plus TV News correspondent Habila Darafai filed in this report. Barely 72 hours after the declaration of result by the Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, it continues to generate issues by the opposition parties and residents in the state. Women of all ages took the streets of Waf Road to express their displeasure over the outcome of the election result in 23 lucky government areas. The women leader, Northwest comrade Aishatu Medina, who led the protest in Kaduna, says the will of the people was surmounted by the ruling party, an electoral umpire, by abandoning the electoral act during and after the process. She stated that INEC are of result authentic and verifiable to the public domain, adding that even with the over 300 billion spent on beavers and other materials for a free, fair and transparent election, INEC could not deliver the will of the masses. Everybody knows that the Electoral Act stipulates that once the margin, the difference in the margin is below the cancelled vote, that vote should, should even be declared as inconclusive. That is even regardless of the fact that so many of our votes were, 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 were deliberately reduced in various local governments. Now we, we said they should refer to the RF, which was created by the uh, INEC. It was INEC. RF is not PDP's property. They further lamented that INEC went ahead to announce a winner of the governorship election, despite high numbers of cancellations and some polling units and contention and the result that emanated in the process. They said that and went ahead to declare a winner. That means the, the, the INEC is subjective. Is serving the purpose of the ruling party to the government. It's not being transparent, and we cannot continue to take this. Now we are we are writing a petition to INEC to review this declaration in Kaduna State because it has that power to do, do so. Some of the protesters who spent several hours in a queue to vote for their preferred choice say that is not what they voted for, as their vote did not count. <laughs> that they collected this thing and they give it to the person that they want. A small child of three years is crying because of what they have collected from us. Please, we are praying. We are calling the people of Kaduna State and all the nation. They should stand for us, that we want this election to be back to us. They called on the international community, the judiciary and INEC to ensure that justice reigns supreme and restore the mandate of the masses for equity and transparency. We vote Isa Ashiru Kudan, and Isa Ashiru Kudan we need as a governor. Let the international body intervene for us, and we want God to, to intervene for us. Ashiru Kudan, he's the one that wins, and we need him in, in the seats. We don't need APC, we need PDP. We are tired, we are tired. The people are tired. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.